Master Builders ACT hopes the city's construction industry will take a stand against intimidation and corruption as it makes its submissions to the Trade Union's Royal Commission. The CFMEU refutes allegations it's involved in illegal activity within the Canberra building sector. It could mark the beginning of the end for an alleged culture of intimidation within the Canberra construction industry. I think just that, that groundswell of, um, of courage that comes through and, and I think just even that can change our industry here in this community. Master Builders ACT says the Royal Commission into Trade Union set to take place in Canberra next week will hear allegations of corruption and intimidation by the Construction, Forestry, Mining and Energy Union. It's just continuous bullying and, and intimidation and I think that's where it's a uh it has a huge impact across the, across the industry. Um, it has an in impact on the costs of, of building, but it also has a, a great social impact. It's alleged workers and contractors on construction sites are intimidated into signing enterprise bargaining agreements, which sees the union and its associates profit. Our members are told that they won't be able to work, that they'll be excluded from the market unless they sign this particular document. CFMEU ACT Secretary Dean Hall says there is intimidation on work sites, but it's not from the union. Workers are forced to onto body hire arrangements, they're sacked if they raise safety concerns and they're intimidated in, into low price, low paid jobs and insecure work. The union alleges form work companies within the ACT are paying workers below wages outlined in workplace agreements. This is a small fractionist group of builder developers who run an agenda for one reason and that is to drive down the wages and conditions and safety of construction workers so they can put the profit in their back pocket. The Royal Commission hearings begin in three weeks. Harry Frost, Win News. The RSPCA says it's disgusted at...